Yo, what up everybody, it's your boy, Uncle Jesse. Time for a little 2020-21 North Basketball Box Break number uh, three. Uh, we do need to random the Hornets, however. So let's go ahead and do that. Uh, let's roll the die here. We're going to go nine times. I got the random on the screen. Uh, so basically, uh, everyone has a shot at the Hornets. Whether you bought a team through the store or got him in a filler, you got a shot. Uh, we're going to go nine times. It'll go to the top name. Uh, so, as always, good luck, everybody. Thank you, Isaac. Okie dokie, or the chokies. Good luck to the homies. I try to make that right. All right. Anyway, here you And the money shot. Nine. CBK. The top name. Very nice. All right. Last chance for any trades. Got all 30 teams there. Doesn't look like I'm missing anything. So, anybody want to trade? Base hit, baby! Let's go! That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about, baby. That could be the game winning RBI right there. Big, huge hit. All right. Doesn't look like anyone wants to trade. Ooh, a redemption. That could be huge. All right. Let's see what we got. Uh, Peyton Pritchard to 99. Rookie for the Celtics. Not for nothing, but this Marlins uh, Dodgers game has been pretty good. Trey Young, also pretty good. To 99 for the Hawks. Also pretty good. My boy. To 25. Bam. Out of bio. Watch him win MVP and Defensive Player of the Year this year. I'm calling it right now. Book it. Stud right there. Uh, speaking of the Heat, I think he could be a, a really good player. You know, maybe not an all-star caliber player, but I think he could be a solid, solid player, kind of like uh, Montres Harrell kind of type of guy. Rookie relic for pressure to chew for the Heat. We got a jumbo material for Mr. Kobe White of the Bulls. That is to 99. In the finals, the box office, Giannis Antetokounmpo, relic, numbered to 99. Will the Bucks win the championship this year? It's, the be it's their best chance. 
Cleveland Cavaliers old school mojo for some old school. It'd be old school for JMS. He's been watching basketball for like two years. You don't know about the future Hall of Famer that is Drew Gooden. I'm kidding. He's not a future Hall of Famer. He he was uh, he was okay. Yeah, let's let's be honest. Uh, but he was pretty good uh, for a little guy, anyway. S number seven out of ten, Mr. Spud Webb. Low Hawks Mojo, right there. Uh, does anyone know how many championships uh, the Knicks have? They don't have many. Uh, as a matter of fact, I think they have one. I think they have one uh, NBA championship since the merger. And uh, this dude, arguably the greatest Nick of all time. Oh, they got two total? Well, I think he's got all two. Mr. Walt Frazier, 7 out of 10. Very nice. As great as Mr. Ewing was, never won a championship. So, uh, how great was he really? I'm being sarcastic, of course. And now, for, well, it's already ruined. I know what it is. Uh, but you don't. So, uh, let me hide it and show it to you. We got the Rookie Patch Autograph Black and White. For Mr. Danny Avdija. Who? He, he's, a, he's actually kind of good. Uh, Danny Avdija for the Wizards. Maybe the next Luka Doncic? Maybe? I mean, th we, we could be having a whole different conversation a year from now. You got to be patient with these basketball players. If it doesn't work out in like a year or two, then it's crap. Just, you know, you got to give these rookies usually a year or two. If they don't pan out by year three, you can give up on them. Ain't that right, Rara? Uh, and that's the break. Uh, thank you, everyone. I'll get it out there.